Yo, what's up, guys? Welcome back to a brand new episode of The Legend of Zelda Tears of the... Uh, my brain. Welcome back to another episode of The Legend of Zelda Tears of the Kingdom. So, I, uh, I didn't get as much food as I hoped, but... Whatever. This works. I'm pretty sure this works. I It should be fine. Hopefully. But, uh, there is something I really want to try, because I'm actually very curious... So what's the strongest one that I have? Uh, this one, yeah. Moment of truth. No way. No way! Yo, look how cool it looks now! It has like the Zonai symbols on it! Yo! Okay, that's cool. That's really cool. So the Master Sword just doesn't have... So, plus 25. I'm really curious. Oh, that's weird. And it, like, forms the item when you swing. Okay. That's sick. That That's actually really cool. So, anyways. Uh, I don't think I've actually manually saved the game yet. Since I've been getting all the food. So I might as well do that. And, yeah. Uh, Pura said talk to Jasha, so... I'm sorry, Taro, you're not the right one for the job. Aww. Come on, don't say that. I've got to let... Um, you've got to let me cast my line to the depths, too. I'm capable of deciphering some Zonai script. Who else can tackle that stuff? Yeah. I mean, your skills would be super helpful to me, but you're the one in charge of the Zonai survey team, after all. But you aren't uh, heading up to the Ring Ruins investigation in Kakariko Village anyway, uh, Taro. But aren't you heading up my brain? That's where your focus should be. Those fallen ruins are huge and exciting. Big enough uh, to see from Lookout Landing. So please, finish your work there before asking to join the new research. But... Uh, but to read first-hand Zonai history, that bait's too juicy to pass up. Okay. Ah, Swordsman. Uh, someone... Someone else is here for the job already? Oh. I guess that's a lost cause. Everyone seems kind of busy. I'll head back to Kakariko Village and just stare up at those ring ruins. May as well head out before uh, I get in anyone's way. Bruh. Aww. Taro is an amazing person, and he's first-rate uh, archaeologist, too. But he loves Zonai research so much that he'll bolt from a project to chase any new discoveries. Oh. I've been looking for someone to help uh, with my investigation of the depths. I mean, you'd be best for the job. I'll help. Thank you. I'm sure everyone will feel better knowing you're on the case. You know, I'm curious what I heard about Hyrule Castle too. Doc is chasing that, so I think it'll be okay. Besides, my discovery might hold a clue about finding Prince. We've gone over this. Can you explain? Can you explain to her that she's dead, please? I'll explain everything to you this way. Oh, this is a main quest. Do I even want to do this? Wind, fire, water, lightning, and spirit. The five sages have awakened and entrusted you with their power. You still don't know uh, where the demon King Ganondorf is. Apura says she suspects the depths. If you work with Joshua... Who's been investigating the depths? You might gain a lead. Okay. This thing, bro. Alright. Swordsman, this way. So remember that fragment I had? The one that showed a single mysterious figure. I found more fragments among the, uh... Among the things in our survey team brought back from the depths. And guess what? They fit together like puzzle pieces. Okay. Ta-da! Just look. Oh. Feast your eyes upon this amazing mural. This scene shows uh, that there's a whole series of statues down there. Like the one you found for me last time. But what really caught my attention is the way they're oriented. Now, each figure is pointed towards the next one in the series. Until it ends with that last statue, facing uh, 
facing a final destination, a building that looks like a temple. Hmm. Also, these large uh, ears on the figure at the front of the building, that's gotta be one of the Zonai. And there's a strange hand symbol that seems to be responding to whatever the Zonai is doing. So to collect my thoughts on all of this, I'm pretty sure if you follow the gaze of each of those statues down there, you'll reach that structure. I'm also betting that the temple-like building holds some of, holds something of, Zon of Zonai origin. I've heard that the Zonai wielded mysterious powers. I wonder if this correlates to those powers. Of course, uh, all of this is still just speculation on my part. So, that's where you come in, swordsman. I want you to find a temple structure depicted in the mural. Initially, I figured uh, I could just go myself, so I gathered a bunch of bright bloom, uh, a bunch of bright blooms and supplies. Aww. But they pulled the kid card on me and said I couldn't go into the depths. So here. Okay, that's good. Uh -huh. You can have these too. All right. Yeah. Bright blooms and arrows are perfect for exploring the depths. There's the added bonus that checking out the depths might provide us with clues to help find Princess Zelda. So if it all works out, uh, maybe you can snag some mysterious power for yourself and gain clues about Princess Zelda Wheat. Bro, she's dead. Bro, she's dead. Nothing but good things, right? Thanks for your help with this, Swordsman. Okay, each one... Okay, hold on. So, each one looks toward the next until the last gaze is at a temple-like building. That's the focal point of the mural. Joshua thinks that this place may be real and hold a special Zonai power. Okay, so where in the depths was that statue again? Was it this one? Alright, so I guess we're going on this little quest. I'm just curious, how broken is the Master Sword right now? It is literally a fusion. Like, we have fused something with the Master Sword. Like, surely this means something. Okay. So this guy... Oh, I see. I see. It's interesting that the Master Sword still doesn't show any damage. Like, I'm wondering if it's saying that the Master Sword is just so strong that, like, I don't know, it just has infinite damage. I mean, I might want to try killing an enemy with it real quick, just to, like, see. Oh, wait. Instantly, okay. Oh. So I'm assuming this is where um, we're going to find a clue on where Ganon's just chilling. What even is this thing, though? This is not a Zonai. I'm still curious on what this even is.
What is that? Frogs? Yeah, I'm not going near that. Just saying. I don't like that thing. I don't like that thing. I really don't like that thing. Let's get a better picture of it. Oh. Oh. That's nice. Hi. Good picture, good picture. That's all I care about. Thank you. Good picture, good picture. Anyways, I'm to save the game and pray I don't die. Yo, chill out. Wow. Hey, how about I just try, like... Can I not even attack the thing? Oh, I, I, ju I just can't kill it. Okay. Okay. So, best to probably avoid that. That is... Bro... Bro, that thing is so... <sighs> Bro, let me climb. Bro, I hate this. That guy is scary. That dude is very strong. I think we're good. A statue was pointing this way. Okay. Man, exploring the depths in post game is going to be so much fun, though. That was too far. Oh no. Okay. It's all right. Okay, well that's one of those guys over there that gives you like a not decayed weapon. I don't know how that works, but
Oh, I'm out. Okay. I just want to talk to you real quick. Soldier's broadsword. Oh, look at the stick. Goodbye. Oh, it's those things. Oh my god, they eat they eat the bright blooms. Instantly. Okay, well that's kind of crazy. Facing that, uh, this way. Oh. Well, that's unfortunate. I was hoping to shoot that uh, way further. Bro. Well, you guys can have fun with that. Grove of Time. Oh, my bow broke. Oh my god, stop doing that. Is that it? Okay, well that might be it. Is this like another- is this like an actual other temple? So, is there another temple that we have to do? Oh wait, save. What are you doing? Save the game.
Alright, so what is this? Great Abandoned Central Mine. Oh, yep, and there's the place. Okay. Authorizer verified. It's moving. Conferring auto build to authorizer now. Please utilize. Please utilize it as you explore and, and uh, excavate the depths for Zonite. What? Oh. Wait, so we're just getting it? We're just getting the last ability like that? And it's something called auto build? Well, that's it. Instantly recreate your Ultra Hand projects using nearby items and Zonite. Autobuilt records your previous creations. Did, did I just see what I thought I saw? Did that thing just give you the power we've been researching? That's incredible. Could you give us a demonstration? Let's see what the text has to say. Hold on. Um, this ability will allow you to commit, uh, to commit any structure you create to memory. Any object committed to memory can be instantly reproduced. Ah. I know just what I can. I know what just uh, what just to use it on. Oh my god, my head. As luck would have it, both of our vehicles just broke, and we've been struggling to put them back together again. Oh. Uh, the one on the round pedestal lost a wheel, ah. and the one on the square pedestal has fallen to pieces. But I think if you put the wheel back onto the first one. You should be able to use your power to repair the second in no time flat. <laughs> so come on, let's see it in action. Fix them up quick. You can start by repairing the one on the round pedestal. Okay, so... Yeah, that's it. No. Oh, look at that. The wheel's right back on there. Snug as a bug. Now, it's time for the main event. The one in... No, 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 no. You don't understand. You don't understand, buddy. I just screwed up your car. Bro. Uh? Hey, what's the big idea? Uh? He's... No, bro. I'm trying to... Okay. Well, both of your cars are screwed, then. Okay. You do you. Sure thing. Whoa, it's like I'm seeing double. Building less than no time flat. This is exactly what I was hoping for. Thank you, Agent Power. The techs were right after all. I'll say, the power's incredible. Oh, Master. What? Oh, are these Yiga clan members? Yep. Oh, look at that. The legends were true. Oh, hi, Master Koga. Great work, both of you. You two, stranger. Credit where credit is due. Credit where credit is. Yeah, do you realize who you're uh, talking to right now, buddy? If there's one foe I'll never forget, it's the man who casts me from my Gerudo Desert hideout in those in the un eh. Into these very depths. Oh, so you've just been here since. It was you. Now I live for vengeance, both upon that no good Zelda and upon my sworn enemy. That means you, Link. We meet again at last. And don't try to tell me you've forgotten me. We are bound by fate, you and I. Cap, hear my name and tremble in fear. I am the leader of the Giga Clan. In the depths of I from the ashes rising. Master Koga. 
Hi. I saw it all. I saw the moment you obtained the ancient power we sought for so long. The highlight of the uh, of the musty old text text we found in this land. It remembers objects you've assembled and can instantly reproduce them. A long a long lost ability from the distant past. So you you you're cheating. Here we are, working ourselves to the bone to build things by hand. And you can just whip them up in an instant? That's not fair. Mm. Who asked? You know who could have used that power? The one we worship and revered. Uh, the Magnificent One. If we offered it to him, we would we would have crushed you and Zelda both. You just walked right up and snatched it away. Now I'm going to snatch it back. Oh, okay, so we're doing this. Bet... Dab me up! Repair yourself. Oh, what is this fire remix? Hey. <laughs> I have the Master Sword too, by the way, so... This bozo! This bozo! Wow, guys, this guy is so scary, bro! Two got that freaking tractor. Wow, you're, you're scaring me so much, bro. I, 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 well, shiver me timbers, bro. <laughs> this is so scary, guys. Shiver me timbers, on God. Oh, okay. Oh no. It's another one, and it can go faster. Well, shiver me timbers, matey. This guy is so crazy. Get out of here. <laughs> oh, you pesky little pest. Why won't you stand still and let me squish you? Because I'm not stupid. Well, fine. I suppose I can let you off easy for today. You think you're so smart? But I've already found a whole bunch of ruins down here. I saw your little trick there. Use your right hand to get that construct going. I'll grab that power. Uh, you cheated me out of... Cheated me out of for myself. Off at the, uh, uh, the southwestern abandoned mine. And the magnificent one. And I will guide this world to its miserable end. And there's nothing you do to stop us. Sure. You do- <laughs> Bruh! So don't follow me. I was expecting him to crash into the rock. Okay, so that's a, uh, side- a side quest. Uh, alright. What you got for me? Oh! Equal to 100 normal- What? What does that mean? Okay. Excuse me. Thank you for repelling the trespassers. I hope you'll pardon me for listening in on your conversation. That man mentioned an abandoned mine to the southwest. I suspect that he is referring to the former Gerudo mine. That place flourished with activity long ago like this one. Or was consistently unearthed and refined. There are statues that point the way to the abandoned Gerudo mine. Follow them to reach their destination. I recommend you begin by making your way to the light you see over there. One more thing before you set out on your journey. There's something uh, I would like you to have. Please speak with my associate when possible. So this is a side quest, though. So if I want to go to uh, Mr. The Depths, just as Joshua thought, uh, when you went to each statue... When you went where each statue was looking in the depths, you found your way to a temple-like building. There you acquired the Zonai ability, Auto Build. Report your discovery to Joshua at Lookout Landing. Thank you for driving out the trespassers. I would no longer need to hide in order to avoid detection. There's another reason uh, that is good you have come. I see you have the ability to Auto Build. That means this skimma, skimma stone I carry is for you. The stone slab depicts schematics of things such as Zonai vehicles. Auto build gives the schematic and builds 
it on command. Saves it. Okay. Oh. Okay, that's cool. That's actually really good. You should now be able to auto-build an additional design. Please wait while I prepare the necessary parts uh, for you to test this uh, schema stone. The schema stone can help you build things you've never before imagined. Hope you find this one useful. Sorry. I'm going to go to that light route. Just gonna get this for a save point. Just so I can come back here later. Alright. So yeah, uh, now it's time to go back to Lookout Landing. Interesting, so now we have auto build, finally. It's interesting, though, so... Yeah. I actually do like that, though. The idea of having something like auto-build, because now... Not only will it save the stuff that I make, it will also save... Like, we could also get these, uh... Stones that will literally... Just give us the thing right away. It's really cool. So, honestly, I can't wait to mess around with that later. Is it time to talk to Pura again? Mm -hmm. Linky, welcome back. So, any news from the depths? At this point, you've gathered the five sages together and return and return the Master Sword to your side. All we have to do now is locate the Demon King. Greatest Zelda don't trust her final wishes to us. We can't uh, let them amount to nothing. We have to find him, and quickly. Sorry, let me gather my thoughts here. I can't think of anywhere on the surface you might be. The depths seems likely, although we can't be too certain. I'll leave uh, it to you to head up the search. That said, if you're investigating the depths, ask Joshua, ask Joshua for help. I'm sure she'll have useful information for you. Yeah. Okay, the rest is up to you. Hmm? Swordsman, what is it? You look very pleased with yourself. Could it be? Uh, auto build? The ability to instantly replicate things you've built? And schema stones? Oh. So there really was a Zonai temple housing mysterious power down in the depths. Mm -hmm. hmm. That may also mean that some of the things you've collected from the depths may give us other clues. Wait here just a sec. Um. Mm, not that. Nope, not that either. Aha! Here we go. <laughs> here, swordsman. Okay, the stone slab. Okay. So, what's this gonna be for? Oh my god, let's go. Okay. This is a schema stone for a balloon, right? So, if you use it with auto build, you can replicate a balloon, right? I'm thinking. Yeah. That balloon over there belongs to Goggles, but it's broken right now. You think you might be able to fix it with auto build? Eve, so exciting, I wanna see it in action pronto. I'll go prepare uh, really quick. Alright. Okay. Swordsman, everything's ready. Please demonstrate how auto build replicates things. <laughs> Alright. Uh hot air balloon. Oh that didn't work. Yeah, I can't believe it. You rebuilt a balloon in an instant. This this is this mysterious power goes beyond scientific explanation.
Goggles. Goggles. What are you yelling about, Joshua? Inconceivable. My balloon, it's fixed. This must be the mysterious power to zone I had. Never thought I'd see such a uh, marvel with my very own eyes. Thank you for making this a reality. Please take this. I've been saving it for a special occasion. Okay. I still haven't been able to figure out what that is. But judging uh, from that light, it's got to be uh, Zonai in origin. Since you could use Zonai powers, I think it would be better if, uh, for you to have it. Yeah. There was an incredible power lying hidden in the depths after all. I think I'll keep researching the depths going forward. Who knows? Just might find a clue about Princess Zelda. If you make any new discoveries in the depths, please let me know, Swordman. A swordsman. Okay, so I guess now we're just going straight to Ganon. Um, yes. Did you need something, Swordsman? No way. Koga, the leader of the Yika clan, was there? Ooh, this is dangerous. I gotta regain my composure. Okay, come this way. So you face Koga in the depths? Hmm. What's the leader of the Yiga clan up to down there? What I know, the Yiga clan is a super dangerous group that schemes against the kingdom of Hyrule. And Koga has had it out for you and Princess Zelda for a long time. You do anything to put an end to your lives. Despite everything we're looking uh, into already, we can't just take our eyes off of this threat. Besides, Koga could know what's happened to the princess. That would make a lot of sense. Uh, if you go... If you do go after him, keep in mind that I'll be continuing my search of the depths from right here. Uh -huh. Oh, by the way, do you know about the Forest of Time, south of Hyrule Field? There's a chasm there, and I've gotten reports of another series of statues found at the bottom of it. These statues are different from the one you showed me using the camera. You seem to point in the way somewhere, uh, point the way somewhere, too. And do come near where you got your auto-build ability. But I don't stop there. These statues lead farther southwest into the depths. Uh -huh. Where they go is anyone's guess, but I bet there's a destination far beyond that building worth seeing. Oh. I'll keep gathering info about what's in the depths, so be sure to stop by and check with me sometimes. Alright. Alright, so I guess that's it for now. We're, we're just gonna go for Ganon. At this point, you gather. Okay, I've literally done every. I've, I've done everything you've talked about. I've done everything you've talked about. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Okay. Oh yeah, this is a quick shortcut. So I guess that was just to get the final power. And now, after that. You know, I'm assuming that was all just to get the final power, and then after that it's just like, oh, well, you know, now since you've gotten the final power, uh, go ahead and beat the game. I think that's what that was for. Not that we'd necessarily need it, but more just like, hey, you know, you still have, you probably still don't have this power, uh, you should probably go do that. Alright, well here we go. Oh boy. Oh, what happened? We just lagged in the air there. Gloom's approach. <sighs> oh, it's that thing.
Oh my god. Yeah, I could climb. That's a problem. Well, I think I might as well just fight it. Bro. Okay. No, get out of there. Oh my god. Okay. Oh no, don't run away. Okay, is this actually where I want to be? Okay, come on, can the stupid thing please? I have a feeling this is not where we're supposed to be. Oh no, we're supposed to go down more. That's the problem here. Okay, I'm dumb. Where? Oh, hi. Uh, any more? Hey, you know, it'd be very funny. Yeah, I don't like the shield. Uh, at the moment, and how it's going. Alright. Good thing that's over. I have no clue where the game wants me to go, though. I can't go up there, can I? Okay, I guess we just keep going this way. That looks like a battlefield. That is a Lionel. <laughs> nope. Oh no, I wanna- What the frick? Bro, was that from the- Bro, there's a ceiling! 
I'm sorry to inform you there's a ceiling, Lionel. That's cheating. Oh, well, there goes, like, all of my health. Bro. That right there was so cheap. I really hope there's some place I could save before fighting the final boss up here. Like a save point so I could just like come back later. Bro, this is so bad. Bro, nah. Nope, time to leave. Hey, nice seeing you guys here, but I have places to be. Bro, I have places to be, thank you. Oh no. Okay. I guess it's down here. Dang, we're going far down. I'm I'm noticing that. Oh no. The power of the sage of a sage cannot reach you. Oh, you're joking. El Bozo. Oh. Never mind. That's dumb. Why can't the power of a sage reach me, bro? That is so dumb. Oh, no. Wow, okay. Okay, guys, I'm back uh, to this part right here. So, I just saved as well, because... Man, if, if I get struck by gloom, I literally can't fight. That's the problem. Which is why gloom is actually the most dangerous thing at the moment. Just, like, it's crazy. It makes literally every enemy dangerous. Because if I get hit by Gloom, it's over. Like, I have to literally reload my save because who God knows how strong Ganondorf is. I'm probably already going to be getting one shot enough. Oh, Lord. Nope, leave me alone. Leave me alone. Bro, no, 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 I had a plan here! I, I hate this. Oh, my. I had a plan. Now I have to reload. Oh, my God. This is so bad. I had such a good plan. Oh my god, this 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 final boss is gonna be insane. Like unless they of course like of course the final boss has to be balanced, which is a whole nother issue. I feel like the main question here at this point should just be how the frick are they making the final boss balanced? And now I think I'll save my game here. And jump down. Except here's the catch. Where is it? Where is it? Come on, where is it? 
I know I saw an exit. There it is. Just get as close as you can to the exit. Alright. Oh god. Yeah, so no more sages, I guess. Alright, I'm gonna save right here. Like I said, there's gonna be a lot of save abusing here, and you can't blame me for that one. Okay. So there's a guy up here. I really hope I can avoid him. Don't sit there acting like you could see me. You know you can't. Rush him. Okay, problem. Okay, okay, okay. Okay. Uh, okay, bro. Oh yeah, fun fact, there's gloom hands here. Um, well, it's called ignoring them. Okay, so this guy's gonna see me no matter what, so I think the best idea... is just get right here, wait for this dude to walk as far as he can back there, and then just bolt. Are you serious? Oh my... Bro, this is so bad. Oh wait, no way. No way can I just cheese that damage. Please let me cheese it. I'm begging you. Please tell me this is before I got hit. Let's go. Nope. I'm not dealing with you. Oh. Forgotten foundation. Oh my god. Hi, Gibdos. Hi. Do I have anything that's gonna break through rock? Well, frick. Well, that's a problem. Hi, guys. Um... Wow, okay, bro. Hold on. I just want to see how strong you are. Oh, of course. Okay, um. Bro, what? Okay, cool, cool. Uh Okay, this is an issue. Well, look at my health. That's wonderful. Um Could a spear break through this by default, maybe? Like, if I said screw the ruby rod and I got the spear, could I, like... Oh, this is a problem. Oh, boy. 
Maybe Zonite, because it's hard. And it's like a rock. Could that work? Oh, wait, I had a bomb flower. Okay, I'm stupid. Um, also, there's this, too. Okay, well, I'll hold up. I'm just gonna, like... New idea. Could I? Maybe? Just maybe? I'm gonna have to reload, bro. Oh my god, why is this so annoying? Bro... Okay, so I have a plan. I'm gonna lure him over here. Got him, okay. Thank you. Okay, Royal Broadsword, don't care. Uh, thank you, just gonna get all that again. And now I have the ultimate plan, since I don't have a weapon that could just smash through that. I mean, unless... No, none of these rocks are grabbable. Okay. Then I have a very simple idea that should hopefully work. Oh, come on. I did not want to use it on you guys. Are you <laughs> Bro. That didn't even hit it. It hit the stupid... Oh, my... Bro... Bro! Let's try that again. It's very simple. I want to... Do this. Thank you. That's not enough? Okay, sure, I got another one. Thank you. Also, I'm noticing, is this the place that... Yeah! So this is the place. Are you serious? Dude. Dude, this is so stupid. I don't understand. Like, what are you supposed to do if you don't have one? Oh, I see. Thank God. Okay. I was about to say, like, what are you supposed to do if you don't have something that could break these rocks? Like, are you just screwed? Oh, the dragon. The master sword. Just want to reveal these. And yeah. That's wild, okay. So yeah, those were the mural the murals that were uh you know, hidden at the start of the game. Interesting. I'm gonna save again because I am a coward. Alright. So yeah, this is okay, yeah, we're just about to enter the place, right? If this is where we started at the game, like at the start of the game, if this is where we were, then why am I climbing the wall? I am not Spider-Man. Stop, Link. Wow, well... I guess this is it. I am assuming this is where the boss is going to be. 
Oh boy. Well, there's no going back now. Oh god, is this the battlefield? Okay, it's not. I'm noticing the music's getting more intense. Oh, yeah. Okay, this is probably actually it. Okay. Here we go. Time to beat the game. Bro, look at this place. We're landing right in here. All right, let's see it. All right. Oh my god, really? Bruh. Bro, get yo. Oh. Oh, yo, let's go! Bet. Let's go. Let's go. Let's go. All right. The Demon King's army. Oh, dang. These guys get, like, one-shotted. Okay. Bro. Get your squiggly-diggly out of here, bro. Y'all think you're so cool, like... These guys think they're cool. Spoiler alert, they're not. The big guy needs to go. Okay, whatever. I'll, I'll, I don't mind losing one. Um... Oh! Um... Thank you for that. These guys are gonna die in like five seconds, because the Master Sword exists. Oh wait, no, these, these guys are different. Wait, no, 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 no. Different difficulty level. Wow! Okay, bro, chill. I really hope I don't have to deal with Gloom in the final boss. That's gonna be terrible. Bro! Why are you this desperate to not fight me? I think Ganondorf is a little scared. Not gonna lie. Thank <laughs> you. 
I 100% think Ganondorf is scared, bro. Why are you summoning all these monsters instead of just fighting me, bro? If you're like this Demon King, bro, you're like, you know, scary Demon King. Oh, frick off. Doesn't that take like 10 in real life minutes to come back? Oh, God. Okay, let, let me just see the Master Sword. Bro. This is the worst time it could break. Literally the worst time. Bro, come on. Can that be it for the stupid army now? Can you actually fight me? Oh my god, bro. You are so desperate. These better not be the ones that crawl. They are. Okay. Bro, I am so screwed. There, there's no way. Okay, I got a decent amount of arrows. Where are you, Riju? You know what time it is. This is a problem. Just a second. No, okay, you know what? Screw it, whatever. Oh yeah, nope. I had the shield on too. And it still killed me. How far back do we go? Wow! You know what I'm gonna do? I have a strategy. I'm gonna hit this sword against the ground like five billion times. Okay, I'm gonna do a strategy that's so stupid yet effective. The strategy is stupid yet effective. I'm going to be hitting this sword against the ground over and over again. Uh, then I'm going to wait patiently for the 10 minutes to be over. Which then I can get the new Master Sword back. Right? I can get the Master Sword back. And I actually have the ultimate plan. Uh, Dang it, I don't have any gemstones I could fuse, I don't think. Do I? Dang it, I don't think I do. Alright. Um, maybe Shock-like Stone would work? I don't know. I'll have to see when I get there, but... Basically, I'm just gonna be, like, doing this for a little bit. Uh, I will be right back when the ten minutes are over and after this breaks. Alright, I'm back, so I waited out the minutes. The Master Sword is back. I'm gonna get, um... I'm gonna get an item first, though. Uh, on it. Let me just see, what do I have that has the best fuse attack power? Oh. Oh, but that breaks w right away, doesn't it? I can't use that. Okay. I'm gonna pick this. Alright, then. Let's do this again. Time to save the game once more. And go down. Alright, here we go.
Can I skip this? Yes, I can. Alright. Get him. Bro, okay, okay, hold up. Oh, that got him. Okay, cool. Dang it. Okay, this is gonna be really tough. That was quick. Oh, thank you. That's actually gonna be very useful. Should I fuse them? And I have enough time for a fusion bit fight, don't I? <laughs> Alright, now, uh, phase two again. Wow, like these guys are taking down my health so badly. Okay, I need, I need one of those. Like I really need, okay, bro. What I don't like about this is that I don't think there's a way I can get to the surface without losing all of my progress of me coming down here. Then I have to do that all again. That's my problem. I would go get some, like, what, gloom-resistant food? Isn't that a thing? And, like, it will still hear- it will, like, still heal me, right? I think. And if that's the case, then, you know, I would love to go get some. I would absolutely love to go get some. Oh my god. I hate these guys so much. That didn't hit that one? Oh my god. Oh, Riju. You know what time it is. I don't even care about the other ones. I just want you dead. All right. Just the flying ones left, I think, right? Okay. Yep. Okay, that got one. I was hoping to get all of them there, but okay. Sure. Are you serious? I have exactly three arrows left. This is a problem. Die. Did 
Does that call them to me? I, I heard somewhere it does. Okay, it does. Cool, cool, cool. It missed. Now, please explain to me what I'm supposed to do about the situation now. So, I have one arrow left. There's two of these guys left. What do y'all want me to do now? Over here. Okay, so now do we just have to rush this guy and hope it works? Yes! You know, Bo, you are a lifesaver. Alright. Bro, come on! I thought that'd be the last one. Why are y'all spamming enemies, bro? This is some major cap. This is some major cap. Please tell me they'll die right away, too. Oh my god. Nope. 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 This is bad. I'm coming to the realization that I might actually have to try to beat the final boss with a single heart. Because... This is too wild for me to figure out. Are you... Oh, now you run out. Let me guess, that was it. That, that Now I'm gonna fight Ganon without a sword. Oh my god, are you serious? Please tell me there's something before then. Oh no, not you again. We're not doing- Oh no. We're not doing this again. We- Nope, 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 nope. Can we run? Are we gonna go ahead? Okay, let's dip. Yeah, let's go. Let's get out of here. Is there a section where I could just like wait for the Master Sword to recharge? Oh, thank God. No shot. Bro. Bro. <laughs> Bro, can I just wait this out? I think I can. Uh, can I save here? Oh, no. Okay, whatever. So in that case, I will be right back, guys. I just need to wait for, uh, the Master Sword to completely recharge. Alright, so it's back. Um... I don't know what I'm gonna fuse it with this time. Uh, I guess this could work, right? I think this is the strongest one I have besides the Gibdo Bone. All right then. Well, I think I'm. I think I'm ready. I have one heart. This is gonna be a problem. Hi, buddy. What are you gonna do? Bruh, 
Bro, what you doing? Oh, I see. That's what you're doing. All right, here we go. Regardless, I will reshape this world as it was meant to be. I will crush any opposition. I will rule. That is what a king must do. Stop the cat, bro. This is what a king must do. Like, bro, get out of here. Bruh, dude thinks he's special, imagine. Oh, is this the line? You witness a king's revival. All right, bet. And the birth of his new world. No. Yep, pull out the sword again, just like you did last time. Okay, it begins. Ooh, okay. How about this? I gotta learn, like... Come on, I'm trying to... There we go. How much damage? Oh my god! Take this. Oh, come on. Let's go. Come on. I can do this. I can do this. This is way too easy. Um, okay. I see. Oh my god. I'm scared to die. Because I might have to wait 10 minutes again for the sword to recharge. I don't know how I'm doing this. Just die, please. Phase two, come on. Oh, what? Okay. Okay, buddy, calm down. Now what? Okay, now what? What you gonna do now? <laughs> what a feeling. I'd almost forgotten the thrill of battle. That feeling as blood surges in my veins. I am not even near the limits of my power. Oh, all right. Excuse me? Excuse me? What? Bro, what are you? Bro, you are straight up breaking the game, my guy. Like, you are so strong that you freaking broke the game. All right. Broke the freaking health bar. Uh, I don't think so. Nope. Oh, no, 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 no. Okay. This is really bad. I don't have a shield anymore. Hey, can the Demon King, like, actually attack me? Not one of his phantoms, please? I'm interested in fighting the Demon King, not the Demon King's phantom. Oh boy. Do we settle this now? 
Dang it. Come on. Oh my god, that was close. I'm trusting in the sage to take care of the other ones. Yo, guys, take care of the phantoms. Don't worry about this guy. Why can't I get a flurry rush? Why can't I get a flurry rush? Oh, God. Bro, the shield's been with us since the start of the game. That's kind of funny. Come on. Yeah, that one I'd say is the easiest one to actually dodge. The other ones are pretty difficult. Oh no. Oh, okay. I have to be smart. Okay, phase two of phase two. Got it. Okay, what? Now what? Oh, that's fun. Okay. I'm terrified right now. Oh my god, he's being a coward. He's using projectiles. What? That didn't kill me? Oh, never mind. Okay, so that one attacks that way. Got it. Please tell me my Master Sword's back. Or it just spawns me into the boss fight. Please. I'm begging you, game. Just spawn me into the boss fight. Oh, thank God. I have three hearts. Huh? Okay, well, I'm going to pause and come back when uh, I get back to that phase again. So, uh, yeah. Okay, I'm back, I'm back, I'm back. Here we go. This took, like, maybe five attempts to get back here. Let's see what I could do. Oh, what the frick? That's a problem. What? What? Bro. You're gonna do it again, right? Yeah, what the frick? How do I hurt you? God, those stupid projectiles. Bro. He's gonna dodge, right? Yeah, what the frick, bro? Okay, well, th this is a problem. Okay, I tried to be smart. Okay, that's what I get. Wait, now that I think about it, I have an idea. Nope. K 
can't do the idea now. I don't know how I'm going to do this. Oh. That's fun. Alright, so here's what I did. I looked it up, right? But don't get mad at me, hold on. I looked it up. But here's the catch. I figured it out thanks to looking it up. I know, I'm very big brain for making that assumption. But, in all seriousness, uh, basically... He's not only vulnerable when you do a flurry rush. Duke could also be attacked. Like when this happens, if I just go for it and let him dodge, he will then go at me again very quickly. That's when I have time to move in. Dang it. So now, do that. Okay, so it's always that one with the club, got it. Let him dodge. Okay, so I guess I have to dodge that way for this. This is very difficult to figure out. So I'm assuming once again, I just have to dodge up. Just get ready. Dang, okay, he is quick. Okay. Go, 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 go. Come on. But see, there's times like that where he's vulnerable. So even if I screw up the flurry rush, I could still hit him. Let him do it again, and now wait. Oh, okay. It depends on which way he hits you. Okay, so he hit me like that, which means he's gonna... Oh my god. I hate how crazy that timing is. Oh no. Okay, that means he's gonna do this. Wait. Dang it, this is tough. Bro, that is way too fast. I do not have the reaction time for that. Like, I hate to say it, but I don't think I can actually kill him with flurry rushes here. I don't have the reaction time for that, bro. Okay, let me try again. What? Bro, you just did that! 
Okay. Okay, I think this is just straight up unfair, not gonna lie. The amount of times I've retried this part... Like, bro, I'm not even gonna lie right now. I think this is just unfair. And it's not like, oh, ooh, look who's salty. Like, nah, bro. Genuinely, though. What the frick? And I can't even go back and get good, like, better gear or anything. I'm just kind of stuck in this loop now where I have to just keep fighting this guy. It's kind of annoying, not gonna lie. Okay, so I decided... Screw doing the flurry rush. That's not gonna work. I'm just gonna straight up, like, wait for an opening, and then just attack him. Oh, come on. Bro, what? Bro, I just stopped running for literally no reason. Okay, I'm gonna have to try this again. Yeah, see, that's the problem. Let's go! Okay, did not expect to actually successfully do that. I'm sorry, but I hate this one. I'm dodging to the side. Dang it. I'm always dodging to the side with this one. Like, I literally don't care. Don't care, dodge to the side again. Oh, okay. I screwed it up again. Wonderful. I love screwing it up so much. Okay. Okay. To the side it is. Oh wait, no. Okay. That okay, that was my reaction time peaking. That's never happening again. I'm always dodging to the side because I don't trust this anymore. Whatever, you left an opening, I still gotta hit him. Oh no, so scary. Okay, it's always to the side because I don't trust this one. Nope. Bro, that is some major cap. Major cap. Okay. To the side. Let's go. Get him. He's so close. I have one goal. Don't be dumb. Dang it. Okay, he's gonna dodge again. Come on. Okay. I don't know what he's gonna do now, so I'm a bit worried. No, come on. My stupid L reaction time. Tr 
trust issues, still dodging to the right. Nope. And that would have been the end of that if I just wouldn't have bad reaction time. Okay. Which way is he going? Let's go! No way! Oh my god. Okay. I'm assuming there's a phase three. If this is like Breath of the Wild, so I'm not... I'm not getting too excited, but I finally did that part at least. Hey, maybe a checkpoint would be nice though, because I don't want to do that all again. Okay, I see. So, dude just really ate that. What can I say? Dude was hungry. I mean, dude's been here for a while. I'm pretty sure dude hasn't had- Oh, not that again. Oh, no. We're not doing this again. It's the stupid thing that flew around Hyrule Castle in the first game. That's what that is, I'm pretty sure. Okay, there's a loading screen that gives me hope that there's a checkpoint. That gives me a lot of hope. Don't destroy it, please. Two loading screens. Interesting. Okay, we're doing this again, where you just become this stupid blob of malice. Oh, you have hands now. Okay, I guess that makes you original. You have hands. Oh, that's meant to be a dragon. Okay. Demon Dragon. Dragon of Dragonfied? Dragonified? Demon King? What the frick? I don't even know how to say that. Yo, look who it is! Yep, thanks for the ride, bro. Alright, I guess this is it. The final phase. Alright. I'm ready when you are. J just just start just start the fight. Bro, this looks so cool. We're above Hyrule and everything.
So how's this gonna work? Oh, I see. Jump off. Okay, having Tulin would be great right now, just saying. Oh, I see there's spots on its back. If only I had arrows to actually, you know. Alright. Oh, what the frick? Wait, I can heal. No way. Oh my god, let's go. Okay, I don't know how I'm going to do this. I don't have any arrows, which is of course a big issue. I have no clue how I'm going to uh, damage him, though. I don't have arrows. Oh yeah, now it's like... Okay. Okay, so that's what I have to do. Got it. Yo, pick me up, bro. Let's go. Okay, this is actually a really cool final phase, though. I like this. Definitely way more interesting than a Dark Beast Ganon, though, am I right? Because, listen. As much as I like Breath of the Wild, listen, bro. Dark Beast Ganon was the most L final boss phase ever. Like, literally the worst in gaming history. Like, bro, that was just terrible. Okay, so it's covered in malice, and I'm assuming I just have to wait. Alright, come on. Um, thank you. So now what do I do? Okay, is it just the same thing again? Bet. Run. Oh boy. The music is going so hard though.
Let me on. Okay, pick me up, Light Dragon. Where are you? Oh boy, got the Blood Moon. Yo! Oh, that looks sick. Oh, are we supposed to go for your head now? Bet. Oh, that's gonna be hard because he's shooting the stupid. Okay, give me just a second. Remember, don't get cocky. You don't have tool in. Uh, all right. Yo. Oh, I see. Is that it? Didn't it break? Stab it. Just one more time. Get him! It was fun, Tears of the Kingdom. Goodbye. Bro. Goodbye. Bro. Dude. Bro, what? That was a uh, big explosion. Yep. Wow. Just taking a picture of that. It looks awesome. Now what? Oh, are we gonna see Zelda? <laughs> oh, that's Sonya. Hi. Come on, let us at least see Zelda one more time. Oh my god, is Zelda the dragon?
Wait. Is Zelda the dragon? Oh my god. I just pieced that together. Because if Ganon... If Ganondorf turned into the dragon by eating the stone, that's probably the forbidden thing, and Zelda did it. Oh my... Okay, this makes more sense now. Please tell me you're alright. Oh. See you guys. What's happening now? Get her. No, get her. Oh, do we get to play this? Go. Nah, Zelda, listen, bro. Nah, it's been a long game, but it's it's finally time you and Link just like go back to doing whatever you were doing. Come on. Get her. I don't want to see Zelda die. Oh. I'm stupid. That said hold. And the music, too. Come on, Zelda. No way, Link. You grabbed her this time. That's crazy. No way, Link actually grabbed her this time. Oh yeah, into the water. Because, you know, we don't question logic. IRL, that wouldn't happen, but it's a video game, we don't question it. Are we good? Zelda, I swear to God, if you don't wake up. Nah, because here's the thing. This Zelda is actually my favorite one. Like, out of all the games. 100%. Just has the most personality, in my opinion. And yeah, she's awake. Link. How are you? I was... We reached you, after all. Demon King. I'm not in a dream, right? No. You did it. Oh, Link, you really did it. But how am I? Raru and Sonia. No. I understand. been sleeping all this time but when I felt something like a warm loving embrace I woke up a warm loving embrace huh Link, I met such wonderful... 
beautiful people. I saw Hyrule as it was. I have so much to tell you. So much happened. Oh, Link. I'm home. Yep. Wow. Bro, that was... Bro. Man, that... Yo, that was crazy, though. And that's it. Bro, I, I just can't. After, like, how many years has it been? Like... I mean, not since the game was announced, but since Breath of the Wild came out. Because technically, ever since Breath of the Wild came out, people have wanted a sequel so bad. So in reality, trailer aside, like original E3 trailer aside, we've technically been waiting for this game, if we're counting the people that wanted a sequel after the first one came out. A lot of people have been waiting around six years for this game. And that's just wild to me. And the trailer came out like what? three, four years ago, the first trailer for this game, when they announced that it was being made. And it's just like, man, it was worth the wait. It really was. I know I didn't get to explore the world that much, but well, that's because it's a let's play. I feel like that is actually one thing that I want to say right now. It's the one reason why I skip out on Let's Playing a lot of games that I get. It's because... Like, I want to be able to enjoy the game and go through it at my own pace. You know, when you're in a Let's Play... You kind of have that pressure to beat the game. Not as fast as possible, but just progress through the game at a decent rate. You know what I mean? Which is why sometimes I don't like Let's Playing certain games. And I'm not even gonna lie to you guys. I was heavily debating, I'd say about maybe a day before I recorded my first episode on this game. I was thinking to myself, like, after I did that Breath of the Wild stream, I was thinking to myself, like, do I really want to record this Let's Play? Because I want to explore and just experience the whole game for myself and really see what's happening. And go at my own pace. But, you know what? This was alright. Like I said, I'm probably gonna play this game a bunch more on my own time. But like I said before, because I didn't say before I'd play the game on my own time. Okay, start over. What I'm trying to say is, when I play- I'm gonna play this game on my own time, a little bit. Probably start getting a bunch of good armor so I don't get one-tapped by everything, you know, that type of stuff. And then also, I'm gonna make sure that, um... You know, I'm going to try to stream this game a little bit. It's going to be a while before I stream it, though, because I have a lot of other types of videos I need to get done at the moment. And you got to remember, the time I'm recording this, remember, I record these videos a bunch in advance. Yeah, Bayonetta Origins, I kind of screwed up with it, but I record this, I recorded this game a lot, each, almost every day. And so it is currently at the time of recording this. It is 9.34 p.m., and it is, uh, it is May 28th, 2023. Of course, I should leave out the 2023, because of course it's still coming out this year. You know what I mean, though. So it's the 28th of May right now, when this video is being recorded. And this video probably won't come out for a long time. So, of course, I can't stream the game right away from the time I'm saying this. But even once that final episode drops, which is, you know, when you're seeing it right now, 
still don't expect to stream on this game in a hot minute because I have a lot of other videos I need to get done that I'm probably going to wait until this Let's Play is uh, fully released to do that. Man, it's going to be a whole thing, but honestly, yeah, this game was fire. And listen, to the people saying, um, it was just DLC, listen, bro, I, I gotta be real with you. This was not DLC, okay? Because I feel like it's one of those things where people don't realize that there is a lot of games that reuse the same map. It happens, and honestly, I think it's okay to do that as long as you change it up enough, which they did in this sense. I'm pretty sure all the towns I've been to have been changed in some way. Except Rito Village, that one wasn't changed too much, but overall, this is definitely a different game. Like, if this was DLC for Breath of the Wild, it would have been way too long. Like, it's one of those things where people don't realize that, listen, you can't make like a 30 to 40 hour game DLC. Like, these people are so going to complain about that. I'm going to bet once the majority of people have beaten this game, they're going to be like, like talking on Twitter and all these other places being like um actually here's the problem uh you could have just made this DLC for Breath of the Wild and see that's where the problem comes in because if they were to actually do that can you imagine a 40 hour DLC that's just way too long for DLC DLC to me is when it's something more short and sweet and uh, uh, the majority like, the most amount of time it could last, I would say, would be about five to six hours for a DLC. I don't think DLC should be any longer than that. And maybe, if I'm pushing it, ten. Ten hours. If I'm, if I'm, if I'm being generous. If I'm being generous, ten hours. But, overall, you can't make something this big DLC. It's just, no. And, honestly... Obviously, I'm, like, honestly, I'm not one of those people that go on Twitter or anything and, like, complain and stuff and, like, fight for the game or whatever. I'm not one of those types of people. I just don't care about all the drama. What I'm saying is, though, is that my personal opinion on this game, I don't know how anybody else feels, but all I know is, me personally, I feel like this is a game. This is not DLC. This is a sequel to The Legend of Zelda Breath of the Wild that we've waited so long for. Oh, we got the reverse music. And just after everything, man, it's just... It's crazy to see that this game actually met my expectations, I'm not gonna lie. I wasn't expecting, like, entire giant new world expansions. Like, oh boy, we're adding more to Hyrule. Like, the, the island Hyrule is, is gonna expand. Like, no, that's not what I was expecting. I was expecting something like this, you know? Pretty much everything that was here, like the amount of content that was here, is the amount of content I was expecting. I don't know what expectations other people set for themselves, but this pretty much almost on point met my expectations, which is why I'm very happy about it. The one thing that I didn't like too much about it, though, is the fact that there were just so many times I'd get practically one shot, and I just personally think, I get it, that could be because of my lack of armor, which it probably was, but especially with like that Gibdo boss fight, I'm not gonna lie, L boss fight, that Gibdo boss fight, the Queen Gibdo, literally worst boss in the game. Like, literally, y'all can't prove me wrong, literally worst boss in the game. And now, honestly, it's just nice to finally beat this, because I don't know if I mentioned this in a previous episode, but I was kind of rushing to beat this game a bit, and I have two reasons for that. The first reason is, well, you see, uh, there's something called spoilers online that aren't necessarily the most fun thing to have. Do you know what I mean? That's a problem, the spoilers, which I was desperately trying to avoid. And I would say I avoided them pretty well. There was a couple things I got spoiled on here and there, but overall, I'd say I did pretty well with avoiding spoilers. But 
the second reason is also because, hey, I have other games to play, you know? And also the fact that, listen, I just wanted to be able to beat this game for the, at this point for the sole purpose of just beating it, because, come on, it's a sequel to literally, possibly at this point in time, being my favorite game, which is The Legend of Zelda Breath of the Wild. Now, I d I'm debating whether this is going to top that. I think this game's better, but at the same time, I'm just kind of thinking, like, the end. Like, I'm just still kind of thinking. Would I want... Like, I I'm trying to see, because... I think if this game gets DLC of any kind, that would automatically make it better than Breath of the Wild in my eyes. But I feel like both games are kind of neck and neck, in my opinion. I'd say Tears of the Kingdom, though, is slightly higher up on that list. Because, well, it's Tears of the Kingdom. It's the sequel to Breath of the Wild, and that's not, of course, the only reason. The main reason is because of how much stuff this game has. It has slightly more than Breath of the Wild, that's to be sure. Let's see what the save file looks like. Yep, it has a star on it, just like Breath of the Wild. But yeah, my whole point is is that I love this game, bro. You can bet I'm going to be playing this over the course of, like, you know, this Let's Play releasing. Because, like I said, it's May 28th right now when this is being recorded. I don't know. I, I'd have to double check, but I'm not going to check during the recording, of course. Um, what date this episode's coming out. I have no clue. It's probably sometime, like, I'd say early June, probably. You're probably seeing this right now, and it's early June. Maybe, like, around... Wait, no, no, no. It could be around maybe the 7th to 8th, possibly. I don't know. I have to see. But, either way, yeah. Tears of the Kingdom... Definitely awesome game. And I want to say this again, because I've said this for so long on my channel, and I still am sticking to that statement, especially now that I've played it. I want this game to win Game of the Year. Not just because it is an amazing game, that 100% deserves it in my eyes, but also the fact that, uh, I said it once, I'll say it again, Breath of the Wild was the first time Nintendo's ever won Game of the Year, in the Game Awards. I think it would be so funny. If their second win was Tears of the Kingdom. So imagine their first ever win for the Game Awards is Breath of the Wild. Their second ever win for the Game Awards is Tears of the Kingdom. Which is the sequel to Breath of the Wild. I just think that'd be funny. Like, like it's not like the main reason is, of course, because the game's really good. But my secondary motive there is the fact that, you know, it's just the fact that the game, it, it would just be so funny <laughs> to see that be the case. But one thing I do want to check is I want to see how long I've played this. So I'm going to pause so y'all don't see my friend code, so just give me a minute here. Dang. Okay. 40 hours or more. And that's probably thanks to a lot of the one and a half hour videos that I have in this Let's Play. That's probably the reason why it's like that. But yeah. I guess, I guess that's gonna be it for the Let's Play. It, it was so fire. I don't- I can't say it enough, man. It met all my expectations. And hey. If the game gets DLC down the road. Depending on what it is, because listen, like I said, I have my own reasons for not playing DLCs sometimes, or this and that on the channel. But depending on what the DLC is for this game, if they have any, I might let's play it too. It just really depends if it's something that I feel is worth my time. Let's say it's something like the Master Trials again, right? I'm not, I'm not gonna, you know... Let's play that. But if it's something like Champion's Ballad, yeah, I'll 100% let's play that. But yeah, uh, that's going to be it for the let's play. I'm hoping on releasing 
Uh, I already have plans for my, like for my next let's play, which is uh, it's either gonna be a one-off video or a let's play. It depends on how I figure it all out because it's a it's a very short game. But I found it on Steam, and I think it's awesome, and I want to Let's Play it. And so, you know, we'll see where that goes. It'll either be a one-off video, or it will be an entire Let's Play. But finally, for the five billionth time, that's going to be it for this Let's Play. Hope you guys enjoyed it, and well, I'll see you guys next time. Bye. Yo, can the recording stop, please? Bro, bro, it does not want to stop. It's literally being like, no, it's not over yet. We're not going to stop.